Some stories are so easy I couldn't goof them up if I tried. So it is, I hope, with Linwood's Sunday Jam on Route 1 in Gouldsboro. It's open mic, everyone's invited, and everything's free. It's an original, not all the gold. Every summer Sunday, Linwood Boucher holds a jam session with an open mic for those who want to take center stage. His is an easy place to settle in, listen to music, and watch the people. It's been going on in 10 years, since just after Linwood stopped working at the mill in Jay. A guy came see me in the fall, and we was talking, and I told him I lost my job, and I said, well, I come up here a lot on weekends, and I said, I, I, I think I'll put it, try an open mic up here. And uh, God, it just took off well, so it is. Musicians started coming, but Linwood was afraid the people wouldn't, so he had an idea. So I said, I know what, I'll give hot dogs away. He built the hot dog stand, added a popcorn stand, put a truck up on the roof, and people loved it. I'm not happy, can't you see? There's a Ferris wheel, a pretend jail, a little something for everyone. One time, tourists took pictures of the hot dogs because they'd never seen red snappers. Linda Brooks and Sylvia Frost come here a lot. And everyone is just like one big happy family. Yeah, we're all one big family. We come all the time and look after each other. And when someone's not here, we look to see where they are. Up on stage, Alan and Patty Howland of Beals Islander play. They're veterans of this stage and used to play on a TV show called Dick Stacy's Country Western Jamboree, so everybody knows it. Patty has an announcement to make. Let's sing all happy birthday to my husband, he's 85 years old today. I'm reaching for 100, so I got 15 years left. It's fun to look around, there's an indoor stage in case it rains, and it seems those who can play just can't resist this place. Christopher Spellman is a great guitar player of summers here, teaches Latin in New York City, and has actually written the scores for a couple of movies. He's drawn to Linwood's Sunday Jam. It, it's just a lot of fun. The, I, the atmosphere is just one of a kind. Yeah. yeah. And, and I, you go back to New York and you tell the people? Yeah, yeah. I mean, everybody who, who knows me like, and knows about my music has, knows that I play up here. And it's, one of my, the high, it's really one of the highlights of my year because it's so much fun. It's a great place to pass some time. Some motorcyclists came all the way from Livermore Falls. It's just getting bigger and bigger every year we come up. There's tons of people here. And I think it's great. Lenny's entertaining and free hot dogs bring people out, obviously. <laughs> there are a lot of reasons to be here. The biggest is the guy who was christened Linwood, but his friends call him by another name. Oh, it's Lenny, you know, delightful, imaginative, I mean, fun guy. Just a really round, all around good friend. How was that hot dog? Not yeah. bad, not bad. It's a red snap. I had to drive three hours to get here. I asked him, I said, Could, couldn't you put it any further away? If you're the kind of person who might drive three hours for a free hot dog, or you just would like to relax for an hour or two, some Sunday, take a drive down Route 1 to the Washington County town of Gouldsboro. You'll see Linwood's right on the side of the road. Linwood doesn't go much after Labor Day, so check out his Facebook page to make sure that he's operating before you head down. He mostly has open mics all summer long.